Hi everyone, it's Dr. Mason, naturopathic doctor at Sports Medicine and Rehab Center and um, today I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about a condition that I have been seeing so much of in the past year and that is anxiety. Um, I think given everything that we have gone through as, as a collective over the last year, we've been faced with a lot of different challenges that have pushed us. Um, so I just wanted to state that and put that out there. Um, we have maybe had experienced some financial difficulties, some emotional difficulties. We've had to really change the way that we do life um, very quickly over a short period of time. And we've had to cancel plans and make way for this new way of living um, and kind of adjust for this new normal. And that, and that experience could have been traumatic. And there's a lot of different emotions that may have surfaced over this past year. Um, one of them being anxiety and people who have generalized anxiety disorder may have had um, flare-ups to their anxiety and people who did not experience anxiety at all may have started to experience it, which is really why I wanted to film this video because the more we know about the signs and symptoms and what our body is really telling us, the more equipped um, and more educated we are in, in being able to handle it in a better light. Anxiety can show up in many different ways and can have different signs and symptoms. So some of them can, some people may experience um, extreme fatigue or fatigue in general. Some people may experience headaches, chest tightness, difficulty breathing, difficulty sleeping, um, heart palpitations. So it's important for us to be aware of what our bodies are telling us. It's also really important um, for us to kind of help screen and make sure that there isn't any underlying condition that could be exasperating the anxiety, such as a thyroid condition or issues with blood, re uh, blood sugar regulation that can also be contributing. From a naturopathic perspective, um, one of the things, the first things that I'd like to look at is diet. Um, it's really, really important for us to make sure that we are eating a diet that is rich in magnesium uh, because unfortunately our soil here in North America is um, magnesium poor and so increasing things like raw nuts and raw seeds in the diet and even avocados can go a long way and dark chocolate I know a lot of us are fans of dark chocolate um, those things are rich in magnesium and can help the body um, and help the body cope through stress full times as well um, the other things that we I like to look at is supplementation with specific herbs like kava kava or lavender um, or even using L-theanine which is a green tea extract that can also help with anxiety symptoms um, and then making sure that we are optimizing our bodies in terms of vitamin b12 and vitamin d also very important is for us to check in with our mind and our bodies during these challenging times and to seek the appropriate care that we need whether it be through counseling um, making sure that we are staying active even though i know a lot of our gyms are closed and it's getting cold outside but movement inside the house stretching pilates yoga Whatever it is that you enjoy doing, do a little bit more of it um, so we can get our steps in and we can get our bodies moving. Um, staying active with our social circle, even if we can't see them in person, but phone calls, FaceTime, those things can go a long way. Um, so staying connected and kind of trying to nurture that sense of community, even though we are still distancing and maintaining that. Um, and then the reason why I love working in an integrative environment is because self-care is so important. So I like to refer a lot of my patients out to massage therapy or chiropractic care or physiotherapy wherever needed to kind of help alleviate muscle tension, which can build up with anxiety as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please feel free to share it with all of your friends and your family members. And um, on behalf of all of us at SportsMed, we are all wishing you lots of health and please stay safe.